so this is going to be a very exciting video we are moving so this is our moving vlog <laughs> Chris just suggested that I start filming because he is taking down our bookshelf that was previously right there. Um, this is the first like major piece of furniture we have dismantled. And it's starting to feel like we're actually doing this. We are getting rid of a lot of stuff. I would say probably at least half of our stuff. Between half and two thirds of our stuff. I don't know what math is. Wow, we're actually doing it. We have a trunk full of stuff for our very first trip to Goodwill. Very excited about it. Some live from the field footage. There's Chris getting the bags out of the trunk. Dropping them off. Bloop, there they go. Just wanted to give a little update. We are doing trip number two to the Goodwill. So we finished booking all of our hotels for our drive, which is absolutely insane. I cannot believe this is actually happening. I had a little like I'm not gonna say it was a panic attack. It was like an excitement attack last night. I was sitting there like, oh my God, oh my God. Oh my. So we are in full swing trip planning. So we have approximately six weeks left here, which means we have six weeks to get rid of all of our crap. And I don't know how we're gonna do it. Um, this is not an update I thought I'd be making at this moment right now in time. Okay, so this morning I got a job offer in Seattle. So we're moving to Seattle. So this is official, this is real. This is literally real right now. This is absolutely insane, insanity. Got off the phone and I screamed and I cried and I called everybody. I just wanted to document it because this is absolutely unreal. Straight up, can't believe it's happening. I'm not gonna believe it's happening until I am out there. Everything just got way more sped up. We didn't think we were gonna be going until the end of March, but my start date is March 1st, so we gotta get out of here a lot sooner than that. Yeah, we kinda have to redo all of our plans. We just got done booking all the hotels too, of course. That's always how life is. God, this is unbelievable. Just wanted to show you, tell you that this is happening, and um, yeah, I'll see you soon, goodbye. Okay, we've reached the process in moving that we're going through all of our stuff and right now we're going through Teddy's stuff and he <laughs> is not enjoying it. As soon as we started pulling all the stuff out, he walked over here and was like, what are you doing with my stuff? Here. <laughs> oh no. He's like, this is not what I asked for. Okay, uh, there's been some major developments. Really exciting thing is that I officially got my offer letter for my job yesterday. So I am just over the moon. I'm so excited about it. As you can see, our home is being packed up into boxes. We are in the process of getting rid of all of our stuff. Let me give you a quick little look-see. So this pile of blankets and this thing of potty pads right there are both going to the animal shelter. Everything on this pile is going to Goodwill. The desk is getting either given away or trash. I don't know what we're gonna do with the futon because nobody wants it. Um, couch, I think we're gonna give to somebody. These are all boxes of stuff to ship to my sister to hold for us or my mom to sell for us. I don't know what we're gonna do with the vanity. I think it's gonna either be given away or tossed because it's in pretty bad condition. We have to give away the TV too. Anybody want a TV in the Orlando area? We still have a lot of stuff, but we need to uh, clear it out pretty soon because we are leaving in like two weeks. Not even two weeks, we're leaving in like a week and a half. Eight days until my last day at work, 11 days until we leave, and 20 days until my first day at my new job. Ted's having a great time because we're at home getting stuff ready to go a lot, but he's not liking the moving boxes, so I hope he knows that we would never leave him behind. Everyone's like, oh my God, I'll take Teddy, and I'm like, <laughs> no. So, uh, yeah, that's what's going on. 11 days till we leave. And we are moving in three days. You can see we have moving boxes all behind me. Um, this is a dresser that my friend's coming to pick up behind me as well. If you had asked me a year ago what I thought was gonna be happening right now, it would not be quitting my job at Disney. So that's pretty insane. We are leaving on Saturday and we'll get there next week and we're gonna go from there. Hello, surprise appearance by me. Kayla is currently at work at her final day of work. I am here trying to get everything situated, trying to get our life in order, ready for the move. We've made six or seven trips to Goodwill. We've had a number of friends come and pick furniture up. I have a very, very, very anxious puppy sitting there with his thunder shirt on. But yeah, so we're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, just three more days. There's like one shot left. All right, last day at Disney.
All right, hello, hello. It's the day after my last day at work. We are going to the park for the last time. Pretty wild. We're going to pick up a few things, drop off a few things. We're saying last minute goodbyes to friends today. We are, we just, my friend just came and picked up our bed and that's out of our house now. So we now don't have a bed for the next two nights. That kind of sucks, but yeah, so it's really happening. It's actually happening. We're in the park. Chris just went to go say bye to one of his friends and I have one last pair of cider, just for old time's sake. We're on our way out of Epcot for the last time. I'm not gonna lie, I'm really sad. Like, and not just sad that like we're leaving, but just sad that it, it just feels like it's time. We said goodbye to all of our friends. I'm really, really sad, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I'm very, very sad. Um, maybe it's just because I've had two margaritas and a pear cider. We're having dinner with some friends tonight, um, and I just can't believe this is all happening. It's really unreal, and I cried a little bit walking out of Epcot. I'm just, yeah, it's just very, very weird. Okay, just wanted to give you an end of the day update. Um, we had dinner with some of my friends. I still have glitter, like, all right here from my eyeshadow, that's funny. Since our bed's gone, we have the futon and a little air mattress set up. It feels like a sleepover, it's kind of fun. Ted did not like the air mattress. Only two more nights here. And we're headed out. Cannot believe how close we are to being done. Um, you can probably hear it's very echoey in here. We just got done taking a bunch more boxes to UPS and a bunch more trips to Goodwill. And the junk pickup guys just came and took a lot of stuff. So I'm gonna give you a quick little tour. No boxes here. Nothing in the Goodwill pile. All this is gone. My vanity is gone. The TV stand is gone. Futon is gone. Teddy's still here. All of this is going in the car, but it really it looks like a lot less, doesn't it? Kitchen is totally empty and clean. Um, just some cleaning supplies here. Literally, cupboards, empty. Oh, that was loud, I'm sorry. Drawers, empty. Laundry room, empty. The bathroom is empty. The bedroom is totally empty too. Oh my God, I can't believe it. I literally cannot believe this. We're actually doing this. We're, we're really for real moving. It's empty. Look at this place. Last night in the apartment, we had a last supper of Chipotle and Teddy's having one last playtime apparently. And we are really leaving tomorrow. We're really doing it. I cannot believe it. Here is all the rest of the stuff that's going in the car. So we took out most of it already. And then this is our bedroom. Isn't this so wild? This is so insane. Packed everything up and it's time to go. So we're leaving bright and early tomorrow morning. It's only about 8.30, but we're probably gonna go to bed soon because we are so tired, we have a real long day. And um, we have to drive a long way tomorrow. We're driving, I think, like nine hours tomorrow, which is a lot. Oh my God, I just can't believe it. I can't believe it. Yeah, so it's our last night in Florida. How is this real? We've lived here for the last eight years. We've lived in this apartment for three and a half years and it's time for something new. So I am so excited. I can't believe that in just a week we are gonna be in Seattle. Oh my God, oh my God, I'm so excited. Yeah, so that's where we're at and I'll see you tomorrow.